Welcome to the Imaginative Nick. Close your eyes, relax, and let the power of storytelling take you on an unforgettable journey. In the depths of the vast and majestic ocean, there existed a magnificent underwater kingdom. This kingdom was home to countless vibrant coral reefs, shimmering schools of fish, and enchanting sea creatures. At the heart of this kingdom resided a compassionate and adventurous mermaid named Marina. Mermaid with her flowing auburn hair and eyes as blue as the ocean depths, was beloved by all who knew her. Her heart overflowed with kindness and a deep connection to the marine world that surrounded her. But among all the creatures in the ocean, Marina's closest companion was a fish named Terence. The tale of their friendship began on a sunny day when Marina was exploring a secluded cove. She stumbled upon Terence, who was basking in the warm rays of the sun. Marina approached him with curiosity. Terence, having seen many seasons come and go, recognized Marina's pure heart and took an instant liking to her. He shared stories of his life, the wonders he had witnessed, and the wisdom he had gained from navigating the vast ocean currents. From that day forward, Marina and Terence became inseparable. They explored the ocean depths together, swimming alongside vibrant schools of fish, and marveling at the diverse beauty of the coral reefs. As Marina and Terence ventured further into the depths of the ocean, their eyes were greeted by a sorrowful sight. A small, vibrant fish, its scales shimmering in hues of white and orange, was entangled in a treacherous web of discarded fishing nets. Its delicate fins were ensnared, causing the fish to struggle and cry out for help. Marina's heart ached with empathy as she witnessed the fish's desperate plight. Without hesitation, she swam towards the trapped creature, Terence followed closely behind. Fear not dear fish, we are here to set you free. She reassured with a voice filled with compassion. With steady hands and unwavering determination, Marina began to delicately weave her way through the labyrinth of entangled ropes. Each movement was calculated, her fingers expertly maneuvering to release the trapped fish from its aquatic prison. You are doing splendidly, Marina, murmured Terence. As Marina delicately worked to free the little fish from the entangling net, a sudden tremor jolted through the water. Startled, she looked up to see a massive ship passing above them, its propellers churning the currents with great force. The movement caused the fishing net to sway and tighten around the struggling fish. Fear gripped Marina's heart as she realized the danger that loomed. With a surge of determination, she redoubled her efforts to untangle the fish before it was too late. The net tugged and twisted, its grip becoming even more unforgiving. Terence, ever steadfast by Marina's side, offered words of encouragement amidst the chaos. Stay focused, Marina. You can do this. He called out. With each passing moment, the ship's movements caused the net to jerk and sway unpredictably. Marina had to rely on her quick reflexes and deep understanding of the underwater currents to maintain her balance and continue the rescue mission. Finally, after what felt like an eternity, Marina's hands worked their way through the final tangle. With one last decisive movement, she freed the fish from the constricting net just as the ship's turbulent wake subsided. The little fish swam frantically for a moment, its body unaccustomed to the newfound freedom. It circled Marina and Terence, expressing its gratitude through twirls and flips. Thank you, you have saved me from certain doom, I am eternally grateful. You are most welcome. You may swim freely and find happiness in the vast expanse of the ocean. Marina replied. As the fish swam away, its scales shimmering in the light, Marina and Terence continued their underwater adventures, their journey led them to a mysterious wrecked boat nestled among the coral reefs. Intrigued by the allure of the wrecked boat, 
Marina and Terence ventured inside, their eyes adjusting to the dim light that filtered through the cracks and crevices. Within the depths of the vessel, they encountered a peculiar sight, a group of jellyfish floating gracefully amidst the wreckage. Their translucent bodies glowed with ethereal light, casting a mesmerizing glow throughout the room. One jellyfish, with a mischievous twinkle in its eyes, swam towards Marina and Terence. Greetings travelers, I am Jester, the jellyfish of jest and laughter. What brings you to our humble abode? Marina spoke with a smile. We were drawn to this wrecked boat, seeking adventure and perhaps even a tale to tell. What brings you to this place, Jester? Ah, uh, dear wanderers, our presence here is no coincidence. We have been entrusted with a magical pearl, a precious gem of immense power. The kingdom's queen awaits its safe delivery. Will you be our noble messengers? Jester's translucent body pulsated with excitement as it replied. Marina's eyes sparkled with intrigue, and she glanced at Terence, who nodded in silent agreement. We would be honored to deliver the magical pearl to your queen. This pearl possesses the power to bring harmony and prosperity to our beloved kingdom. It is a symbol of hope and unity. Jester explained, gently placing the pearl in Marina's hands. As Marina and Terence embarked on their journey to deliver the magical pearl to the kingdom, they faced a daunting obstacle, the dark and treacherous coral reef. Determined to reach their destination swiftly, they made the bold decision to navigate through the labyrinthine passages of the reef, where shadows danced and eerie whispers filled the water. As they ventured deeper, the coral formations grew denser, creating a maze-like network that threatened to confuse and disorient them. Suddenly, a powerful presence emerged from the shadows, a killer whale, its majestic black and white form commanding respect. Fear gripped Marina and Terence, their hearts pounding with trepidation. To their surprise, the killer whale approached them with gentle curiosity, its eyes filled with kindness and understanding. Greetings, brave travelers, don't be afraid. I am Orion, the guardian of these dark waters. I sensed your presence and offer my assistance. Relief washed over Marina and Terence as they realized that Orion was not a threat but rather a benevolent guide through the intricate maze of the coral reef. Grateful for his offer, they explained their quest to deliver the magical pearl to the kingdom. Orion's powerful tail gracefully swayed through the water as he replied. You have chosen a perilous route, but fear not, for I know these waters like the beating of my own heart. Follow me, and I shall lead you safely to your destination. With newfound trust, Marina and Terence followed Orion's majestic lead, their bodies moving swiftly through the intricate coral formations. Finally, after what seemed like an exhilarating eternity, they emerged from the coral reef, greeted by the sight of the kingdom's grand entrance. Marina and Terence turned to Orion, gratitude shining in their eyes. Orion, we are forever indebted to your kindness and guidance. Marina expressed, her voice filled with heartfelt appreciation. Orion's majestic form glistened in the sunlight as he replied. It was an honor to aid you on your noble mission. May the magical pearl bring light and prosperity to the kingdom. With a final nod of farewell, Orion disappeared into the depths of the ocean, leaving Marina and Terence to approach the kingdom's gates. As they neared the kingdom, the currents guided them to the grand entrance, guarded by regal seahorses. Marina and Terence approached the majestic gates. The kingdom's queen, adorned with a crown of pearls and coral, awaited their arrival. Her eyes shimmered with a mixture of anticipation and gratitude as Marina presented the magical pearl, their delivery fulfilled. The Queen's voice echoed through the Grand Chamber as she expressed her appreciation. Brave messengers, you have honored us with your service. The magical pearl shall restore balance and harmony to our kingdom, weaving its enchantment throughout the ocean's depths. And as they stood before the Kingdom's Queen,
Presenting the pearl with reverence, Marina and Terence knew that their adventurous spirit had not only brought them to their destination but had also woven a tale of unity, compassion, and the remarkable beauty that could be found in the depths of the ocean. They had not only delivered the magical pearl but also experienced the transformative power of trust, friendship, and the willingness to look beyond appearances. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell so you'll never miss a new adventure. I can't wait to share more stories with you soon.